feel like the game is in a way better place than it was before. Like we have a uh, before it was all Diddy Kong through Street players, but now they, all these patches happened, and now uh, you have a very, very uh, like a lot of variety in the game. So it's good that they uh, patched the game and made it better. If I could change a few things about the game, I would probably uh, weaken the effect of Rage and probably buff a few other characters. I think it's still very exciting because the way the stock format keeps it so that a lot of people can follow really easily. There are a lot of very high risk plays, very exciting. There's still a lot of viable characters. And just like at this tournament, upsets happen left and right. It's always exciting to see who's going to come on top and who's going to be the Titan to fall. I don't think we'll ever be seeing pools being floated for this game because the nature of the game, especially with Rage being a mechanic, is just too... You... It's, it's just too inconsistent. You can't, you can't keep tabs or you can't, like... Duck Hunt won today. Duck Hunt beat the best player in the world. That should tell you something. In terms of uh, the community, like the viewer count tournaments, um, I think it's only going to get better from now on. Mainly because 2GG uh, announced a circuit. So that's going to attract a lot of people and, and sponsors. So I think this year is going to be uh, the year of Smash 4. Possibly Melee, I'm not sure. But definitely the year of Smash 4. And I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's growing really good. Like. We started with almost nothing into like having like there's so many events like with a lot of money right now so I think it's growing really good and I hope it stays like this because we might you know just just reach where we want to reach like at the top basically. I would have probably stuck with trying to play League of Legends competitively as prior to Smash 4 came coming out I played a lot of League of Legends and I was relatively good so I'm sure I would have tried to pursue that career. I probably be in school. I used to actually, I was in school for languages and like translations. But then Smash 4 like kind of came out and it was like really, really good. And I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try to become a professional in Smash 4. And it's really worth it right now. So hopefully, I'm hoping I'm not doing this like, you know, Smash 4 dies tomorrow. Because that, that would just suck. So I'm hoping really hard on Smash 4 right now. I wasn't playing Smash competitively. I'd probably be just bartending still at my job. I still bartend on the side, but uh, I'll be working there way more, so I'm thankful for Smash for saving me. <laughs> and I like bartending too, but. <laughs> I would still be studying in school. I'd probably be a graphic designer right now. Uh, have a nine to six job and uh, not enjoy my life as much as I do now. And in terms of gaming, I would probably like just play a lot of Overwatch because <laughs> that's what I do now. <laughs> if I wasn't doing Smash Brothers, I think I'd be living a normal life as a college student. Uh, it'd be pretty boring. Uh, my personality would be a lot different too because Smash kind of crafted me into who I am. So I think my life would suck. <laughs>